The Integrated Bar of the Philippines has turned down Bicoy's plea for help. The lawyer's group said his case lacks merit and has suspicious timing. Marian Enriquez with the story. The Integrated Bar of the Philippines has declined the request of Peter Advincula alias Bicoy for free legal assistance. Aside from the case not meeting their standards, IBP said they are also suspicious of the timing. This is an election period, remember? So uh, we, they, I'm, I'm sure they evaluated, you know, how long have you known about these things? Why only now? Because that will also show perhaps uh, motives and uh, objectives. IBP as an institution cannot be perceived to be political. We are, it's, we are very strict about that. Advincula said in a press conference in IBP's headquarters that he is the hooded figure Bicoy, who has implicated President Duterte's inner circle to the illegal drug trade. But IBP said Advincula did not qualify as someone who can't afford a lawyer, a key requirement for them to accept the case. Advincula wanted to file charges against the president's son, Paolo Duterte, and senatorial candidate Bongo for alleged involvement in the drug syndicate. But the IBP said they also found the merits of Advincula's case lacking. Everyone has to qualify also. Everyone has to comply with the minimum requirements. If you don't, uh, it doesn't matter to us who you are. They also also maintained the IBP had no hand in Advincula holding a press con at their auditorium. They are now investigating their employees on how the press con happened in their facility. For News 5, Marian Enriquez, we are One News.